Bismillahirrahmanirrahim. Assalamu alaikum, greetings, so Ishama here and welcome outdoors. Today weather is good and it's the best time to test my 3D printed, my own design slingshot. Let me show you some of the shooting with this. It's pretty accurate actually and I'm very very happy with the results. So let's get to some shooting right away. It's pretty accurate. I'm surprised that accuracy is really nice. Uh, the sight that I had designed is actually working very well. If I aim from the bottom one, it actually does a very good job. Now, only thing that I need to learn is to control the angle of my hand and control the angle of this and then the release. But I'm surprised. Check this out. Most of the shots are actually very close to the target and a couple of times I actually hit the target very well. This is much more accurate than my Rolls Royce slingshot, you know. <laughs> a little bit uncomfortable to hold because it's pretty hard. So I have to put some kind of foam to make it a little bit softer. And it should be good, I think. Very comfortable to use. Now check this out. Ooh. It's completely... I have this Rolls Royce. Rolls-Royce, yes, check it out. Rolls-Royce slingshot, metal, and with a pivoting system and tilting system. So I have been using it for practicing. I love slingshots. When I was a kid, I used to make uh, slingshots using some branches of trees, thread, strings, stuff like that, and rubber from my pajamas. <laughs> but now I have access to 3D printing, so I 3D printed this one and I'm calling it SS1 and it's looking really nice okay check it out hold it and pull it shoot it so this is the 3d printed slingshot people check it out and I'm gonna show you how to assemble it and after that we're gonna go do some shooting with this one and see how it works and after that I will uh, improve the design, take it from here, improve the design, and you know, maybe make something really nice and powerful. Oh, check this out my 3D printed slingshot V1 is ready. All right, let's assemble the SS1, the slingshot one. Uh, we have three parts, in fact, five parts two are the sides, and two are these uh, pieces, blocks that will hold the bend onto the main base of the slingshot. Now this base I printed with 50% uh, infill because I wanted it to be strong and it's going to take all the load and pressure of uh, the bend. So this is what I want it to be strong. It's nice and good, fits very well in my hands and moving this handle slightly up actually prevents you from you know holding it from the middle because if it is in the middle it's slightly uncomfortable and now you can use just like this or like this 
depends how you like to hold your slingshot. I can put these pieces in which will prevent the screw from digging in uh, a lot when you tighten it. So these metal pieces will come here, this one here and this side I will have the piece with the sight. So I'm just gonna put one nut in here first just like this okay once the nut is in you can first tighten the screw a little so it will hold on to the nut just like this give me a moment let me see yes it has gone through the nut now you can see as you tighten the screw piece goes down the teeth are ready to grab this bend now the straight bend I believe is better than the tube and I find it's easier and they are more accurate I've used the tubes as well but I find these to be more accurate you know and you can find them very cheap online uh, local portal right here in China on Taobao they are very very cheap and basically one bend will give you about uh, anywhere from 10 to you know uh, 100 200 shots depend how it goes and how you use it so I'm gonna keep it like this because this is the only way I can see to keep it nice and straight okay and having to have this this part is gonna go in here now also I figured that it turned out to be slightly wider the bend compared to what I designed on the base of uh, the slingshot so just put it in push it down and you can tighten this screw right here the bend is nice and straight and does not twist anywhere in the middle okay and push it down to hold the bend and tighten this good now you have your slingshot ready for shooting you can see how much I'm stretching it and the bend is not going to come out uh, sight and I'm gonna add a very bright fiber optic piece in it and I designed it in a way that you can see it's right in the middle of the bend slightly left slightly offset to the left but it's a nice uh, reference for you right here as you can see from the bend okay if I stretch the bend very nice reference come on you know what to do hit that like button it's right there. I know you can do it. Oh, while you're at it, also hit the subscribe button. Right there. Come on, don't be shy. Just hit it. Thank you very much for all your support towards my work. That I post regular and fresh content on my channel just for you. Hit that like button. Right there.